What's up, everybody? It's your boy Z Farm. Before we get into today's video, I want to shout out the Twitch and TikTok, both of our other platforms that we do content on. The Twitch is obviously for live streaming video games. The TikTok is for live streaming as well, but we also do Diamond Dynasty uh, investments on there as well. Go follow both. Links are down in the bio. And while you're here, go subscribe to our YouTube channel, which you are on right now. Hit the little red button down below. If you like the content that you are watching, you could also click the bell above. And now, Let's get into this video, shall we? What's going on, guys? It's your boy Z Farm here, and welcome in to a brand new episode of Road to the Dynasty. This is episode number six of Road to the Dynasty. This is a Baltimore Orioles franchise mode where I take over my hometown team, the Baltimore Orioles, and try and win as many World Series championships as I possibly can. I appreciate the love and support that I'm getting on the channel, both via YouTube and TikTok. I appreciate every single one of you. But let's recap the last episode real quick, shall we? We played a lot. Well, I shouldn't say played because a lot of it was simmed. But a lot of good moments in the last... A lot of wins in the last game, I should say. Or the last episode, excuse me. A lot of dubs, as you can see here. After the Seattle series, we stopped. Then we continued, I mean, just to end the month of May. Wow, that was just ridiculous. And then to get into June... And have a good start. We did just lose the last series, two out of three, to the Atlanta Braves. They're the best team in the National League. We're the best team in the MLB. I checked after episode number five concluded. But here we go. We are going to start off with now. Oh, I didn't even see that. Wow, the Philadelphia Phillies are now the best team in the National League. And we're going to kick off playing against them. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Right into it. Philadelphia versus Baltimore. The best on best could be a World Series preview. Who knows? We will see. And first game, we lose 6 to nothing. No offense. Cole Irvin, bad start. Could get better. All right, let's see. Corbin Burns on the bump against Colby. Ooh, Seth Johnson. Yeah, finally getting injuries. Um, I'm going to keep him active. Corbin Burns, we're going to let that go. We win 2 nothing. All right. In that Bradish 3 3 game, and we're gonna play it. I apologize, guys. I just watched back some of the videos, and I did not realize that some of the videos did not have audio. The catch here. Number 35. So, Adler. Here we are. Man. We have audio now. We should be good. You should be able to hear the audio in these videos. Here we go, Sir Anthony Dominguez. That one's popped up. Is it good enough to tag? That is Brandon Marsh. We're going to hold. As yeah, that would have been a laser of an out there. Phillies are a good club. The Philadelphia Phillies, they're a great club. And this is a good test in June. Right before July and right before the Yankees series. That, we're going to send them. We're going to send Westberg and he's going to stand Save. up. Home plate. Jordan Westberg, right over. Gets the base hit there. And here we go. We're going to get Craig Kimball warming. 358 ERA. He's got the ERA down. He's got the saves up. He's 21 saves. Trying to make a 22 here. Unless Kobe Mayo does some damage here. Oh, that one. No ball. One strike. That just accidentally raised the PCI a little bit. 1-1. One, one. on the outside there. Kobe Mayo, man, listen, Kobe Mayo has been killing the baseballs of late. We made him an everyday starter. He was just originally against lefties. That one is right to second. That's going to be an out. So Craig Kimball is going to come in the game. But as I was saying, Kobe Mayo has been killing the ball. He made him an everyday starter at third base. And Jackson Holliday has also been killing the ball as well. So, you know, the prospects actually sat down Craig Kimball. Yeah, the prospects have been doing terrific for this club, and that's why we're winning games, actually, is those two men right there, so, great start to their careers, and great start to this series, Cody Mayo has an opportunity to get this one, it's a little too far out for his reach, there we go, O2 count to Brandon Marsh, and that's going to go through, Hayes and seven, Mateo, wait a minute, running on Hayes, and he's going to be out, Got him. don't go high, did that, but we got one out. That one's popped up. 
Alex Bowen with a play. Against Craig Kimball. Got to think the Phillies, they had a shot in the World Series last year. Kimball, or excuse me, a shot two get the World Series. Craig Kimball blew. You think they would have a little bit of fire? Knowing the man that took him out. Three. Alex Bowen sat down on the number third there. They got two outs. Nick Castellanos, here to go. Good first pitch strike. Two Castellanos, another strike. And that's going to be a foul there. Ocean count, here we go. The two seamer on the inside. Ooh, that was nowhere close to the inside. It's actually down the middle for Nick Castellanos. Here that's going to be the this series. Get the series done. Here against the Phillies, the best team in the National League. We take two out of three against these guys. That is a huge series. Anthony Santander, home run. Gunnar Henderson has been killing the baseball as of late, ladies and gentlemen. My goodness. Shout out to Gunnar Henderson. Wow. All right, we're going to sim through this. We play the New York Yankees in New York. Wow. I didn't realize this as well. We are close to the All-Star break, ladies and gentlemen. So... Depending on how this video goes, we might just get to the All-Star break. We might make this a little longer episode, but we'll see. All right. Custom entry, see if we got to get in this one. 5 nothing. Grayson has a shutout. We're going to let him cook. And, uh-oh, John Rhodes broken ankle out for one to two months. We're going to put him with a 60-day. So, wow. Very unfortunate for John Rhodes there. Jordan Westbrook pulled leg. We'll be out for a couple of days. Oh, Westbrook, that's not good. Okay, Seth Johnson is also good to go. The Braves have an offer. Real quick, hold on. It is Craig Kimbrell. <laughs> for Craig Kimbrell, I should say. Uh, Dylan Don is 25. And the shortstop is 20. Um, but I'm not really interested in either of those guys, so we're going to send that. We did win the last one. Uh, let me check the box score real quick on that one. Adley Rutschman Homer, Ryan Mountcastle, Anthony Sonic, Kobe Mayo. I'm telling you, Kobe Mayo having himself a nice little start to his rookie campaign. And here we go for the sweep in New York. Cole Urban on the bottom against Marcus Stroman. Uh, Matt Horvath injured out for a couple days. We'll keep him active. And the Yankees take that 4-1. to one. They avoid the sweep at all costs there. All right, Corbin Burns on the bump in Houston. 7-4, to four. okay. Radish against Valdez. Should be an interesting matchup. 4-1 to one victory. Kobe Mayo once again, home run. Ryan Mountcastle home run. All right. G-Rod versus Luis Garcia. And there we go. Jordan Westberg is no longer injured. Neither is Matt Corbett. There we go. And Houston gets the 6 nothing victory. Okay, we're on to Cleveland already. Wow, not stepping into these games here. AI is... Oh, what a battle that was, man. 12-7 oh, to 7 in Cleveland. Oh, excuse me, at Baltimore. But against Cleveland. And Cleveland wins that one. Call for the sweep, but we got our ace on the mound, Corbin Burns. So let's see. Three to two. All right, we got to step in. Kobe Mayo at the plate. Bottom of the eighth. Let's see what we can do. Colton Kowser on first. Zero out. And well, that's going to be two outs. Because that is a He's out. out. On the out. first pitch. Yikes. <laughs> Not what you want to see that early. All right, and we saw time there. Ties the game, first pick. Wow, what a shot from Todd Tom there. Utah's going to come down. Tie game against the Brooklyn Guardians. And let's... All right. Oh, oh, and let's get somebody warm up. We are not going to get lucky, so Danny Kulon will come out for the night. And we'll pick him up in the tent if we have to. Jackson Holiday, number one prospect. Is he the number one prospect still? I don't know. I think he, I think he graduated, so no longer former number one prospect. Maybe. Number one overall pick in Kansas City. So that's still a good line. There we go. 
Hey. That's just a uh, really terrible pitch to swing at, but all right, Danny Tulo. Now pitching now for the Orioles. Number, number 54. Jenny. Bo Naylor. Kulo. That's out. Up. Good guy. Bo. Josh Naylor and Bo Naylor. All the team. They also got Manzardo. Hey. Right. Manzardo at first base. Cleveland. One ball, one strike. Got a decent future, especially with the first overall yep, pick. Yep, that ball went out. This year. Good. That's going to be a tough play. Henderson, it's a yellow. No, he's in there. Turn to not scoop out. He's in for Cleveland. Number 22, Josh. Josh. There's the brother. Naylor. That ball's foul. Goes out. Austin Hayes. That's catchable. It is catchable. And he's going to go two. Hayes. Got him. Do not run on Austin Hayes. My God. What a throw from Austin Hayes in left. No run up whatsoever. He gets Bo Naylor. And he's got two outs. And he's throwing against And Florio sits down. Strike number three. There we go. Jordan Westberg. Maybe for the win. We'll see. Start it off. Westberg, oh, hard hit ball foul. A little bit early on that one. Justin Crawford, hard to triple A. Lehigh Valley. But Jordan Westberg sends the ball into the Orioles' bullpen. Jordan Westberg. The Bruce man walks it off. Number five in the year for Jordan Westbury. There we go. The production is here. And Jordan Westbury walks it off. Tony Mancelino sends him off, shoots the helmet into the crowd. And the Orioles get the victory there. You love to see it. You love to see it from Jordan Westberg. There we go. Home run, walked it off. Anthony Santander with a home run as well. Wow, he is going to get big money at the deadline. Because we are not gonna we're not gonna resign him. Here we go. Four game series against the team that knocked us out of the playoffs. The Texas Rangers. The Royals have an offer. We win this game. No home runs, but Colton Cowser with a triple. Kyle Bradish, an amazing start. He always does good against a Texas team. Jacob Webb giving up the only hits. But here we go. Austin Hayes for Jordan Lyles. No. <laughs> no, we do not need Jordan Lyles on this team. Here we go. G-Rod against Max Scherzer. 8-3. to three, Or excuse me, 4-3. Four 4-3. To three. Four to three. I was going to say 8-3, to three, and they got me stepping in, but 4-3. to three. And we're stepping in. Here we go. But for the playoffs, I think I'm going to do the sixth inning. We're going to see if we can get anything. Player moments as well. But yeah, the sixth inning, I think we got to step in. And the Russian delivers once again. There she is! There we go. This is a tie. Now, now this is for Texas. And they put in Texas. number 66, Josh Bull. Who is in right? Is it Cano? Let's warm up. Two guys there. Cianel Perez. Uh, the bullpen is kind of tricky. It is kind of tired. I did see a lot of guys. I guess we used last night. Yeah, what? Nice. Nasty sword ball there. Zero balls, one strike. Josh sword. Here we go. Well, Hearn takes the lead by chance. That is bad. I'd like to see Cano's help. If Cano's good, I'll give him two more batters. But, oh, excuse me, it's Tyler Wells. So Cano must have been used earlier in the game, but that is a hard hit ball. Two buckets sent in. And we're going to the ninth time again. Adley Rushman comes up clutch. There we go. Yeah, we're just going to keep Wells in for two batters. 
He's got the stamina to do so. That is a one pick out to Josh Jump. Yeah. Oh and one. Oh and two. Here we go. Oh. Ball. We got two outs. Okay, so Danny Coulomb is going to come. Actually, no, it's CNL Perez. I lied. It is CNL Perez. And here we go against Evan Carter. He was batting 200 on the year for the Texas Rangers. All right. Now, now pitching, pitching for the Orioles. Hee haw! Number 58. Right. No balls. Now. One strike. Perez. All right, we got two outs. Or two strikes. Wow. All this video. That's all right. CNL Perez is an off. Nice curveball there. Here we go. Kobe Mayo to lead off the bottom of the ninth. Can we get some sort of production from Kobe Mayo? And that is going to be, it should be a double. It will be a double. Kobe Mayo leads off the bottom of the ninth with a double. So now we got the winning run on second base. So what if the pitch run? Uh, why not? Hold on. Here we go. Anthony yeah, Santan there. Maybe for a ball to a solo shot in the seventh for Tony Taters. Maybe. A walk-off win is not what we want. Well, two inside tonight. One ball, two strikes. popped up in front of time. But we are not going to send Mayo on that one. One, two, count. Hard hit ball. That is fair. Mayo went back to second. So we are going to hold him. Sometime there will go two, though. A little mistake from the rookie, but that's all right. Still no out. And Jackson Holiday up to the plate, potentially for the game winner. And it's going to be caught. We are going to send him. It's going to be a close play. They say Jackson Holiday. Walks it off. Cody Mayo, the winning run. And there we go. Walking it off against the Texas Rangers. To get the victory. Five to four. Anthony Santander, player of the game. Cody Mayo, three for four. We are, I think, we're thinking. Good awards here. I think we got an MVP candidate. We should have two Rookie of the Year candidates the way we've got our rookies playing. So here we go. DeGrom versus Dean Kramer. 3 nothing. Dean Kramer's got a shutout. And he continues the shutout. All right. Going for the sweep on the Texas Rangers. John Gray. Oh, Kyle Stowers. Out for a few days. We'll keep him active. But, yeah. Oh, he won 5-3. to three. Wow. Adley Rutschman, Colton Kowser, Homer. Solid start from Cole Irvin. Sweep the Rangers. There we go. There's a little bit of redemption. All right. Luis Castillo versus Corbin Burns. Ace versus Ace. Anthony Servideo. Shoulder strength. We'll go 10-day IL for him. Danny Coulomb. We'll simulate that. Mariners went 4-3. to three. Place on the bench. Kyle Stowers. We apparently does not have a good line. Okay, 2 0. So we could get swept here. Bryce Miller versus Grayson Rodriguez. 1 0. Grayson. Okay, we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna enter this one. We're going to enter this game here. G Rod still on the bump against Seattle. There you go. Hey! Hey! 
No balls, two strikes. Any implications? Okay, I was gonna say. Still got a shot, but I'm gonna say this right here. And did not mean to put Craig Kimbrell in, now but pitching now pitching for Bulldogs. Kimbrell's coming in. Six Number out 46. Six. Craig. Craig Kimbrell, all right. Kimbrell. Here we go. One ball, two strikes. Tanner Scott in the closer role. See what people can do in here. Kind of flip the rolls real quick. See what those two gentlemen can do. Back in two strikes. And that's going to go into the back of the left. Hauser's going to cut it off. Now running back. My bad, Grayson. My bad. Second base. Number one. Ryan Blitz. Blitz. Well, that's off the plate. Ah! Uh -huh. Two. Two. Uh, that Go back to the fastball, not going to hook there. And we'll watch it now. Three! Right three, we got him. Now pitching for the Orioles, number, number 66, 66. Tanner, Tanner. Hey. Scott. Rebuilding Orioles was traded away. Very back in a free agent year. He's out. Trying to help the Orioles at the deadline win a championship. Yeah. Good fastball at 99. Count to Mitch Hanniger. That's for a couple of play there. He's got a big one. He's out. We got two outs. All right. Jorge Polanco, here we go. Jorge Polanco. I feel the same thing. I'll just keep doing something here. And, oh, there we go. Got her Henderson. He's going to make the play. Got it. Look at the victory. In Seattle, avoid the sweep. Take one game out of this series. There we go. Okay. Great. 
Grayson Rodriguez, very good performance. Accidentally took him out. Did not mean to take him out. one nothing victory. Another one nothing victory against Seattle to end the series. Here we go against Oakland. Oakland Athletics. Oh, we got a trade. The Padres have acquired Jose Alvarado from the Phillies in exchange for Glenn Otto, Daniel De Los Santos, and Robert Suarez. So they have upgraded the closer position, excuse me, in San Diego. Interesting. Okay. Orioles win 7-2. Gunnar Henderson, Colton Kowser home runs. Dean Kramer goes eight innings. Cole Irvin against his former team. See where this goes. 5-5. Five, five. At second, it is Jorge Mateo. All right. Kendall is still tired. So you know what? Tanner Scott will get the ninth again. Let's start prepping Tanner Scott for some high leverage situations. Coming out of the bullpen, and it's going to be another save opportunity. Jordan Westberg gets him off the middle, and he's going to score Mateo from second. Six to five against the Oakland Athletics. So Mount Castle now. Up to the plate. Can he deliver something? That is hard hit. Is that gone? That is just in the ballpark. Right to Brent Rooker. All right. Tanner Scott. Now pitching now, for Bolton, number 66, Ball. Tanner, Tanner. Scott. Scott. Hut! Pretty good. Ryan O'Hearn with the home run. Tyler Wells came in for three and one third innings. Not bad, not bad at all. So we're going for the sweep. Corbin Burns on the mound against J.P. Sears. And we beat them six to one. Jackson Holiday with a home run. Jorge Mateo as well with the home run. Wow. Did Jorge Mateo go for the cycle? No, he did not get a double. Dang. That is unfortunate. All right. So we're off. We play the Cubs, and then the Yankees, and then we hit the All-Star break, which I think will stop after that Yankees series right there. So, all right. And we'll check everything after as well. All right, tie game, top of the ninth. Tanner Scott's in the game. Tanner Scott being put in these high-leverage situations. Once again. John Gomes. Wow. John Gomes is still in That is Eight. that is something. Oh one. My fastball is in Tanner Scott. We gotta get another reliever to deadline. Just to be safe, just to be sure. We might go after. We'll see. We'll see who's available. We have the pitching the prospects. Oh. Actually go after someone. We will see what we can do at the deadline. We obviously have some top quality. Now pitching for Chicago. Hitting line. Number 11. We will see. Smiling. Also, the draft is coming up. So we are He's out. going to be drafting. It should be a bunch of fun. Oh, 
That's a lucky blue smile. Probably should come up from the loop. We will see. We will go to the line and uh, take the eye back here. Twelve homers on the wheel for Ryan O'Hara. One, two. Do you have Jefferson Flair on my knees? Here oh, I a terrible swing. I don't know what I'm swinging out there. Here we go, Cole Calvin. Oh. Smooth play. Yep. No ball. One strike. Top prospects this year in his rookie year. Would be interesting to see. Oh, that is a wild. One spot. one. Look out. That ball means a lot. Out pass number. We got two outs. There we go. All right. We got two outs. Let's see what we can possibly do. Craig is still now pitching for the Orioles. Number 46. Gray. Ball inside. Kim Roll. One ball. Two strikes. And that is the mayo. Mayo's going to make the throw. And all right. He's out. All we need is the guy from second to score, which I believe is Kobe Mayo. Now running at run second, second base. base. Go. Number, Number nine, nine. Jorge Mateo. Ball. One ball, one strike. Oh, 
curveball there. Home field is in. So Two one. After that, Adley rushed it in case, but if we get a ball in play, that is not to the infield. This game will be over. Two two count. Mount Castle. That's going to be interesting. It's going to be caught right along. The outfield grass, but here we go. Gunnar Henderson, maybe to walk it off. Let's see. Gunnar is going to walk it off. There we go. A single for Gunnar Henderson. That is going to do it. Gunnar Henderson walks it off for the Orioles. There we go. Beating the Chicago Cubs. I'd love to see that. 4-3 to three victory. Gunnar Henderson, two RBIs, two doubles on the day. Craig Kimbrell getting the victory. O'Hearn with a homer as well. And there we go. All right, 62-30. and 30. Wow. All right, Grayson on the bump today. And 16-5. to five. Wow. Gunnar Henderson, Ryan Mountcastle, Austin Hayes. Wow. Grayson, very solid performance as well. Some good work. Everybody pretty much contributing. Austin Hayes with five RBIs. There we go. All right. Final game of the series. Anthony Servideo. He's okay. We'll activate him. Uh, we get a 4-1 victory. Ryan O'Hearn. Colton Kowser. Home run. Dean Kramer. Very good stuff. And here we go. Final series before the All-Star break. It is against the New York Yankees. And wow. The Diamondbacks. Have acquired Jimmy Garcia from the Blue Jays. Very good. 86 overall for Yumi Lin, Jorge Barroso, and Adrian De, Del Castillo. Uh, oh, excuse me. Del Castillo. All right. Does not sound bad. All right. And so video is good to go. So there we go. Losing 8-5 against the Yankees. Austin Hayes and Anthony Santander with home runs. Futures game. See if we've got anybody in that. Mason Miller goes to the Cubs. Wow. Mason Miller going to Chicago for Kevin Alcantara and Luke Little. Wow. That is something. So Mason Miller is now a Cub. Okay. I just wanted to see if I had somebody in the game. I guess we do, but we'll see. And simulate. We lose 4 nothing. We got two hit. James McCann was the two hits. <laughs> okay. And here we go. Final game. Can we get some action? Final game. And we do not. But we're going to stop simulating here. We lose 2 to nothing again. Wow. Okay. So, home run derbies today. We're going to check on the minor league guys real quick. Kate Povich looking good. Connor Norby's looking good. Dylan Tate's looking good. Keegan Aiken looking good. Kerstead getting back into it. Chase McDermott looking okay. Mizorowski looking okay. John Rhodes. Taron Vavra. Oh, yeah, Triple A team's looking very good right now. Brent Loader's getting there. Okay. All right. All right. What's Bowie doing? Samuel Basayo. We might have to call Basayo soon. He is killing the ball in Bowie. Maybe in August we give Basayo the call to Triple A. Let him play down there for a month and then maybe give him a spring training with the big team we'll see gene pinto luis de leon anthony sir video thomas sosa looking okay all right enrique bradfield creed willems 318 batting average another guy we might have to call up jackson ballmeister edwin arroyo okay not bad seth johnson all right yeah these guys are not looking bad tavian josenberg above 200 there we go all right all right ladies and gentlemen so this will be the end of episode number six of Road to the Dynasty. 13 and a half games ahead at the All-Star break. And yeah, we, in the next episode, episode number seven, we are going to...
go to the trade deadline. We are going to make some trades. July 31st, we are going to see who's available. And yeah, all right. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the end of episode number six. I will see you guys in episode number seven. See you then.